A controversial project is now moving forward with their plans for development in eastern Jefferson County. Top Golf is a go, and Oxmoor Center says they couldn't be happier. Kristen Goodwillie was out at Oxmoor Center just this afternoon. What did you see, Kristen? Doug, actually today they put up a fence around the old Sears building at Oxmoor Center. It's the latest news after a circuit court judge ruled in favor of Top Golf in its battle with neighbors of Hearstbourne. This latest development means Top Golf is closer to being a reality. This fence sitting on concrete blocks surrounding the old Sears building is a sign that Top Golf is here to stay. And we just could not be more excited to get this thing open for the public. This is the first movement since a circuit court judge ruled in favor of Top Golf in late June, ending a long battle between neighbors of Hearstbourne. It's going to be uh, such a draw for uh, our community residents and the outlying residents for the whole region. The neighbors in the suit are against the entertainment center and tried to halt its progression. This is the view from a neighbor's backyard that we shot back in March. And these lights, so it's going to be shining right on my backyard right onto the house. So the closest residents are behind a tree line. So you've got the four lane highway, uh, you have soccer fields, and then you have the very heavily wooded tree line, and then you've got the first, the closest neighbors. Kendall Merrick is the general manager at Oxmoor Center. She's now coming to them with an invitation. Hopefully we can address those concerns and um, help them uh, feel more comfortable with the project. Uh, we hope that we'll save them money and worry and avoid any unnecessary and additional litigation. They need to finish construction and demolition plans and file for a permit to finish the demolition work. We believe that the outcome is inevitable and further litigation is only an attempt to delay. It's the first step with no intention of coming to a halt. After the permits go through, they'll need to ready the site and that's when Top Golf will come in for construction. Merrick says Top Golf will bring 500 jobs to the community. We also reached out to Steve Porter, the attorney for the neighbors, who say they are willing to talk it out. Porter says either way, it's likely they'll file an appeal.